Hey guys, welcome back to Channel Sturge here, and I'm back on the Tunnel 11, trying to try to push up to Legend League. Right now, I'm at 4,400 trophies into the Titans 2, and the goal for today is make it up to 4,700 trophies into the Titans 1. And to get to that goal, we'll be using the Clone Super Archer Blimp, making sure to have the set amount of troops as you see here in the Clan Castle, and I have enough full one because you want to only clone the Super Archers and not anything else in your army. I'm also using the Super Barbarian attack strategy as you see here, mainly against Town Hall 11s. Maybe we can attack one Town Hall 12. So let's go ahead, attack a Town Hall 11 and see how well this army does. And the first raid of the day is against this Town Hall 12 worth 45 trophies. I'm gonna go from the left side with our blimp. I'm gonna start off by dropping the warden over here. I'm going from this way because we wanna look for the air sweepers. One's pointed towards the right, one's pointed towards the left. So this warden will uh, follow the balloons, we'll drop all four from here, and then the blimp, and once the blimp is about to leave the circle, we'll drop the warrant ability to help the balloons take down all of those, and then we'll drop the blimp right about here, drop an invis on that, wait a couple of seconds, then dropping the clone rage and the invis. We'll then drop the last one of ours down here, waiting a few more seconds and then dropping the next one that Archer will die in there. We'll drop one more right here. That is the final one. Hopefully we can take down a couple more defenses around here, like the Archer Tower and this uh, Inferno Tower. Hopefully that does go down and no, it doesn't, but that is fine. We took down, I think two of the three Infernos. So now we can head over. There's a lot of area over here we can drop and take down with some cleanup troops. We'll drop some minions and uh, baby dragons around here to take all of that out. And I think we're gonna go from the bottom here to take down this last uh, single Inferno Tower. So we'll drop a few barbarians over here. We have a plenty so we can just spam them in, dropping the Ice Golem, King and Queen over here on the left and a wall break into this compartment to allow for everything to work through over towards that uh, single inferno tower hopefully this everything does go down and it will very good still working up towards the left we'll get some cleanup going with some archers towards the top as well king's ability i should have probably used the actually the ice golem did freeze that so we will take that down where did that wall breaker go did i drop it okay it's right there it will go down uh we'll drop some more Baby, uh, uh, what's it called? The super barbarians over here on the right side. Another wall breaker. The king will go down, but we have some more barbarians we can drop towards the bottom right here. We are attacking a town hall 12. So if we can get close to that three star and get this out of the way, we'll drop a few wizards over here and dropping the rest of the archer or the uh, barbarians towards the right side. Gonna have to use the queen's ability here through this barbarous cannon. 45 seconds left in the area. We have a huge group of barbarians, which hopefully can distract while the queen takes down this last Tesla here in time. And it doesn't, that is fine. I don't think we are gonna get this three star on this tunnel 12. It's gonna be a really close call. We still have that expo and 30 seconds left in the array. So yeah, we're not gonna get the uh, three star on this one here on this town hall 12 but still a decent attack with the super archer blimp in the core taking down the town hall uh the uh, eagle and all of the other defenses around there but getting up to about 95 percent on this one here when that they're not too bad for a plus 30 trophies to start off the day heading on to the next attack we got this town hall 12 worth 45 trophies i think i'm gonna go from the top right of the base with our balloons to start off the warden and then the blimp to head in to the core of the base. Gonna use the warden ability as it's leaving the circle of the warden and then head over to about where that air sweeper is. Going to drop it right on top of it and then drop in the invis. Wait a couple of seconds and drop in both of the clones, the rage and another invis to keep everything up in the core and taking down as many defenses as possible. We take down a town hall for that first star and drop in a couple more of our invis to take down a bunch more of our defenses around the base almost taking down the eagle as well i think we can actually take it down here with the clan castle and i think we do yep there we go wow nice we take that down the town hall and other defenses up to 22 percent on this town hall 12 and we can actually take down that wizard tower there too as well pretty good we have the warden up as well we're gonna go over to the right side with the ice golem the king and the queen a couple of barbarians and doing some more towards the bottom as well to path the uh, heroes in towards Towards that inferno tower as a wall break in as well going to drop a couple more barbarians on the back end and heading down here in a wall break in early dropping a couple more barbarians to path them into 
the uh, other Inferno Tower, which is in two compartments into the base. Drop another wall break to allow for them to push in further. We don't have the war ability, so we do have to worry about that. Dropping a couple barbarians at a time, so we don't waste all of our barbarians through that multi Inferno Tower. We have a couple of defenses on the outside towards the left, so I will drop a couple more over here. Another wall break into the two compartments as well. The T-shape of the wall will open up to both of those compartments. We still have four of those expos to go through with both the hero abilities still up. Drop a couple more barbarians over on the left and towards the bottom as well. Uh, we have a ton of uh, outside buildings at the top here we can take down so I will drop some more archers up there uh, we have most of our barbarians actually taken down we still have the king and queen but about 85% so far 50 seconds left in the raid I'm going to try to use the king's ability before the queen gets targeted but it looks like she did so we're going to have to use her ability here as well so we see if we can get this 3 star on this town of 12 we have 38 seconds left we drop the minions over on the archer tower to take that down to keep up as many troops as possible throughout the last little bit of the raid two defenses left the can on the left will go down and as well as the queen to that one cannon there we got 25 seconds left and i don't really think we will be able to get this three star there's nothing else around the bottom of the base it is just towards the top as those outside buildings do go down we have a ton of small little troops but they will get basically one shotted by these few defenses so it looks like we won't get the three star on this Town Hall 12 worth the 45 trophies. We'll see how many trophies you get from this two star as you get the last Archer Tower still standing for a 99% two star on this Town Hall 12 for another plus 30. And I finally found a Town Hall 11 here worth 40 trophies. I'm gonna go from the bottom right because of the air super pointed down towards the bottom left and one pointed towards the right side. So we'll drop the four balloons the Warden and the Blimp with the ability right about now to go all the way over right to the right of the uh, the Dark Elixir storage, but that uh, Blimp will go down because of the Tango Trap, so we'll drop those spells, the Rage, and another Invis to keep everything up. We have a Clan Castle with a couple of Super Minions, so hopefully we can take a couple of those down, as well as the Eagle, which is the main priority here. We have a Valkyrie in the core of the, Val the uh, Archers here, so hopefully we can take a couple more things down before they do die off, up to about 25%, not too bad. Could have been better, but the uh, Clan Castle was a little bit of an issue. We'll uh, drop a Archer over here on the left and go from the left side of the base with our main push. We'll drop a couple of Barbarians. One on the Valkyrie to take that down. Drop a couple more. And actually we'll drop a baby dragon to take out these super minions here. Hopefully we can take them down pretty easily. Drop a couple of super archers as well, or the uh, the wizards and the couple of barbarians to distract. Then we'll drop the king queen over here on the left side with a wall break into the compartment. We're gonna sprinkle, the, sprinkle in the uh, barbarians and their wall break into the next compartment. We have a decent uh, pathing in it towards the core. We'll drop another wall break. Uh, no, that was a barbarian. We'll drop another wall break there. A couple more barbarians to sprinkle into the core. And that wall break does open. We'll drop another one to go in towards the clan castle compartment here. A couple more barbarians as the ones I dropped earlier fade off with their rage. We'll drop the king's ability as well just in case it does get locked on by the single inferno tower. Drop a couple more barbarians to go into the coral with this queen doesn't get locked on by the inferno tower and we'll get ready with our cleanup going around the outside of the base. Gonna use a couple more barbarians over here on the outside on that cannon. Uh, not too many other defenses. We'll drop one towards that archer tower there and just kind of like sprinkling in the remaining barbarians to take these rest of these buildings down. We have a decent amount of troops still up and a couple of defenses. These two are left to go down before getting this three star on this town hall 11. Queen's ability still up with her being at full health. 33 seconds left. Plenty of time to get the three star on this Town Hall 11 for the plus 40 trophies to finish off the day. As we head back to the base after getting that 40 trophies there, not too bad. And we make it up to the goal for today at 4,735 trophies instead of Titans 1. We'll get the badge here as we get promoted up to Titan 1. Hope you've enjoyed today's video, and if you did want to see me using Super Hog Riders, check out the video I have linked on the screen now. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.